Hi everyone, in this video I am going to explain about four variable k-map representation and how to write the expression for the sum of products. Okay, uh, I am making a separate video for sum of products and as well as a separate video for product of sums. Now, till previous videos I have explained about the k-maps for two variable and as well as three variable. Two variable k-map we have seen just uh, a, b with the two inputs 0, 1, 0, 1 for a and as well as b. But whereas in three variable we have seen a gray code representation and the same can be extended for four variable k-map. In uh, three variable k-map 2 power 3 gives eight different combinations so we need eight blocks. But in four variable k-map four variable nothing but 2 power 4 that gives total 16 combinations total 16 combinations so, so 16 blocks we need actually we need 16 blocks to map the logic ones or zeros here in sop we map logic ones for pos we have to map logic zeros so the four variable k map will be like this total we need 16 box Okay, so let us consider four variables A, B, C, D. These are the four input variables. Four input variables. Okay, so A, B I am taking this side and C, D I am taking this side. That is of your wish. You can represent either in this direction or you can take uh, A, B here in place of C, D and C, D here in place of A, B. Both are accepted. According to that, your mapping will be there, but expression will not change. Now, AB, the gray code format is, it's a unit distance code 0, 0, 0, 1, 1, 1, 0. Okay. And in the similar way for CD side, 0, 0, 0, 1, 1, 1, 0. Okay. This gray code representation, you should not forget. Okay. 0, 0, 0, 1, 1, 0, 1, 1. So the block number is 0, 0, 0, 0, 4 zeros gives 0, 0, 0, 0, 1, 1, 0, 0, 1, 1, 3, 0, 0, 1, 0, 2. So 0, 1, 2, 3. And again it is 4, 0, 1, double 0. This is 5 and this is 6. This is 7. And again see here, it is 1, 1. But the continuation number is here, 1, 0. So 1, 0, 0, 0, it is 4, 8, this is 9, this is 10 and this is 11. If you want you can see 1, 0, this is 1, 0, 1, 0, 1, 0 is 10. And next 12, 13 and this is 14 and this is 15 because all 4 ones. So 0 to 15, total how many? 16 blocks we are having, 16 blocks we are having to represent the ones. Now, what will be the expression for that block corresponding to? Okay, as I have already taken the numbers 0 to 15, I am taking numbers directly here. So, expressions, Boolean expressions, expressions for block number corresponding to the number I am drawing. So, 0, nothing but 4 zeros gives you a bar, B bar, C bar, D bar. 1, 0, 0, 0, 1 gives A bar, B bar, C bar, D. And second one, 0, 0, 1, 0, wherever you are having one, that is a true form and remaining are complement forms. Again, 3, 0, 0, 1, 1, that is A bar b bar c d and next number 4 0 1 double 0 that is equal to a bar b c bar d bar in the similar way you can write 14 triple 1 0 so a b c 
and d bar this is the last one 15 four ones gives a b c d okay so right from the beginning of a bar b bar c bar d bar till a b c d we are having lot of numbers all 16 numbers in this 0 to 15 okay for example for example consider this two table a b c d we are having four variables so a b c d and this is the output expression y Zero 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 one. Sorry, zero 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 four zeros. Zero 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 one. This is one zero one one. Zero one double zero. Zero one one zero one one. Again, all the zeros similarly you can take another eight combinations so 14 and then 15 so now take uh, some example like this and all these are zeros last two are again ones okay now take four variable k map or variable k map now a b c d 0 0 0 1 1 1 1 0 0 0 0 1 1 1 1 0 now see 1 1 0 1 1 1 0 1 0 0 1 1 0 0 1 1 again all zeros last one is 1 1 14 15 and remaining all are zeros okay now see where we can map these two ones we can map because fourth one is not there if we are having this is also one then we can map all four together and these four we can map and this one is alone we can map this with this one or with this one okay left hand side one or bottom one we can map in any way now based on this the expression for the first mapping is a bar b bar because it is in the block of a bar b bar horizontally so that's why those two will come a bar b bar and which is common here c bar a bar b bar c bar plus again it is which is common a bar is common so a bar c d plus here four ones have been mapped in this four ones vertically two blocks have been uh, mapped and horizontally again two blocks are there so which is common here one is common one is nothing but b so b and here c is common b c okay therefore for given example y is equal to a bar b bar c bar plus a bar c d plus b c this is the expression of the given output for your resume from truth table okay so once if you are able to draw the truth table then drawing the k map and keeping these ones together and we can map that is nothing but deriving the expression boolean expression using k map using k map in standard sop format this format is nothing but sop format sum of products sum of products first we are multiplying b and c a bar c d a bar b bar c bar and then we are going to sum them this is plus okay
suppose for example just i am taking different examples a b c d now map these four and these four are mapped together okay how can you map these four these four you cannot do single set and these four we cannot do single set because uh, these four ones these four ones are at the corner of k map so definitely when you fold it this one and this one these two are coming side by side that's why the mapping should be like this okay these two are neighbors each other now 0 0 0 1 1 1 1 0 and again 0 0 0 1 1 1 1 0 how to take the mapping resultant mean term p uh, vertically you cannot take any value because vertically we are having the variation from 0 0 to 1 0 we cannot take a common value but vertically if you see here it is 0 0 1 0 0 is common right side 0 is common that belongs to d bar so y is equal to d bar okay another example another example suppose i am taking a four variable k map okay all ones are mapped all ones are mapped what is the output yesterday i told you already y is equal to 1 because all ones are mapped okay as all ones are mapped simply we cannot derive the expression simply y is equal to 1 that means all are ones okay uh, and Suppose for example we are having the expression we are having the mapping terms like this. So you can map these four. Okay, these two are also there. When you fold this onto this one, these two will come neighbor to this ones. And what about this one? Triple one is there. So these four ones we can do, and similarly, these two ones we can do okay so this is the way of writing the expressions using k map so k map is also very easy once if you understand the k map and then you can move on to the five variable k map okay so i will tell few examples for this four variable k map in the next video so that you can understand in a better way thank you